Hello, our friends, Evolutionary Energy Arts family. Hello there. Welcome back. Yeah, welcome back, guys. The third video of today. We will do what we can when we can. And being people that get up usually around 4, 4 a.m., 5 a.m. sometimes, uh, this is like late evening to us as we're doing this. Yes, we're getting tired. We're getting tuckered out. We are, but we're plugging away. And man, you know, just prepare yourself, guys. It is 10.30.2024. We're literally days away from the s -s 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 gas escaping here somewhere. Election process. Yes, there's a lot of gas on Capitol Hill, that's for sure. Bad actors trying to run massive psyops. Is that the case, George? This is what George thinks. Get this. <clears throat> this shouldn't really surprise anybody. Um, what are we seeing here? We're seeing that Harris has been declared the winner of the election that takes place next Tuesday. And, you know, reporting in uh, Pennsylvania here, four, 52 to 47. Ah, yes. Yeah, it, it's, it's amazing. This reminds me of, you know, horse races and gambling and boxing and gambling and gambling and, you know, all sorts of endeavors in which, you know, it's rigged, but it's not rigged. It's just simply the Pluto return. The Pluto return. We were doing videos on this years before um, all this is going on now currently. And again, this is going back to February 22nd, 2022 was really, it, it's a time period before and after that. We're still living it. But that's when Pluto came exactly to the same place, uh, astrologically, as it was when the Declaration of Independence was signed. This is huge, because when you have Pluto returns, and um, we're talking empires and through all the history, yes, again, the history has been given to us, so we can't trust it so much, but we do see repetitively that things get totally reworked. Indeed, they do. They're never the same. Um, I haven't seen that. It's just sort of this pattern that seems to work to, you know, make people's lives miserable. <laughs> well, you know, again, this is something that's been forecast in the stars. The control system understands astrology. Granted, this is not really Vedic astrology because Pluto's not... Um, included in Vedic astrology and Vedic astrology again is uh, the astrology of the most ancient system that we know which does take into account the tilt of the earth uh, again Western astrology it's interesting too when you look at the history of it they say was actually brought back perhaps from India by Alexander the, the Great uh, you know, again, the the Greek emperor that went and tried to conquer the known world. But what does it mean? Again, Pluto return having its effect. It means things get reworked and they're reborn in different ways. Or they just simply stop being. Every empire has its end or at least its apparent end. So ABC accidentally aired election results of Harris winning PA by 5% with 100% in. Now, why would they do that? You know, Elon says it's a Freudian slip. Yeah, Freudian slip. Hmm. Has it ever happened before? W well, they, they say this was a test. WNEP confirmed that it was a test. But say the graphics shouldn't have made it on screen, but they accidentally did. Test results for the upcoming November 5th general election mistakenly appeared on WNEP-TV early Sunday evening during a broadcast of the Formula One Mexico Grand Prix. The numbers should not have appeared on the screen, and it was an error by WNEP that, that they did. The numbers seen on the screen were randomly generated test results sent out to help news organizations make sure their equipment is working properly in advance of uh, election night. Meanwhile, Fox 10 in Phoenix, Carrie Lake's former station, just displayed a graphic showing Katie Hobbs won the Arizona's governor race 12 days before the election. Again, this is, you know, a blast from the past. 
is so in other words there's precedence for this let me put that out there's precedence as you see 53 47 and ultimately yeah you know it was a big big turn and it, it seemed like things were going one way when people were going bed going to bed as you can see these were the numbers that were being reported and then everything sort of got reversed you know but again this is something that the system is working tirelessly at please insert your comments when it comes to what exactly is the system working tirelessly at mm -hmm. yeah they well they definitely have a goal and and the goal is not to make our lives any easier the goal is to continually um kind of press us down and push us down till we no longer want to fight you know and sometimes that looks like different things coming into your life you know there's people with so much trauma and they can't help but bring about a lower frequency because they're traumatized and when that happens that can make life very very difficult and that's why we're always talking about how to raise your frequency and saying that your your health and your diet and what you put in your body is everything it is so critical to raise your frequency and when that goes up then there's no stopping you there's absolutely no stopping you when that frequency is up there there you can make a million mistakes you know you can do everything wrong but with the right frequency <clears throat> and the right understanding anything can happen you know yes life still comes along and life still gives us lessons that's very 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 important to to recognize but it's very important to heal because it's that trauma that we all have that's keeping us keeping us here you know i can only speak for myself and uh our brother peter peter in poland had introduced us to christoph i gotta say it feels like four or five years ago it's been a while peter's been around a long time uh, he is a Patreon as well. And I do like Christoph. I, I do like him. Uh, I feel he's an honest man. I do not see any conniving, any scheming in him. Uh, you could see the views here are very low. That's because he's kind of a, a, a Polish gem in that the whole world doesn't necessarily know uh, how gifted he is. Um, but they do in Poland. And he has uh, basically been utilized to help police and things like that um, as his abilities are very, very real. And so I was catching up on some of his this morning and spoke about that on the earlier two uh, videos. He does have one here talking about the election. And actually, he's, he's talked about the elections multiple times. Um, you can follow this. this what these are captioned. If you saw his... Polish channel, the views are a uh, hundredfold uh, or, or more. Um, and yet what he sees is, I, I mean, do we have a choice in this system? Um, you know, again, I think he nailed it. I, I like what he uh, said, and I, I do think he nailed it. We are working with a system that controls everybody. So Everybody is controlled in this system, but you do have people with big egos here. They're all <laughs> very big egos. And what he got was that they really hurt uh, 45's ego. And he really does want to kind of get a payback. Uh, I, you know, that's how I was taking what um, Christoph was saying. He's focusing on the election. And he's talking about a lot of young people that want to go with 45 instead of, you know, the protege to 46. And he has this impression that 45 is in danger to the very last moment of the election game and even the period in between as well. Um, he sees that he wants he wants payback is what he's 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 picking up on. And, oh, he also felt that the most danger would be in Michigan, and he hasn't uh, checked 45 schedule. I haven't either. I don't know if anybody already knows whether or not he's going to Michigan. But he felt that Michigan was the most dangerous place for him for whatever reason. Um, and there he's just looking up. But he's he was just saying that, yes, absolutely, every president has to report to unseen people 
that's a given. Yet what you do have is ego, and you do we we saw you know we saw Kennedy get assassinated, and if you look at it closely, there's those that believe the driver literally turned around and and placed that final uh, dagger, so to speak, in in the cranium. So yeah, egos and also you know payback. So, you know, I guess what Christoph was saying, you know, if you had a lesser of two evils, this might be the lesser of two evils. But at the same time, he does uh, get into the fact that um, there is this shadow power structure that really does control everything. And there's some things, some things they could do and there's other things they absolutely cannot do or they might try to do. And if that happens, then, you know, history repeats itself. Mm -hmm. it, it does again and again and again. And as we go up in frequency, we have to keep in mind that this is very, very painful. And, and what they're doing to people is absolutely horrible. This is just something that's unfathomable. And they're trying to blame it on us. And I think we just need to stay banded together and say, hey, no, we, we know the plan because people are recognizing it. Yeah, I mean this. This we we played videos like this before. This is in Spain again, in in the orange orange producing region. Um, uh, there's that's not a new Olympic sport. You know, uh, car surfing is not a new Olympic sport. These people's lives are in danger. This is horrible, and you know the end result is a situation that may be close to what we saw in North Carolina and Tennessee. Um, as the numbers already are are pretty high and people were caught completely off guard um, our beloved family member Zoe uh, is fine she just wanted to reiterate she was fine she was thankful for everybody's prayers and energy but she was saying the buzz there this is her again saying what she's hearing everybody's talking about weather manipulation there everybody is talking about weather manipulation they think it was an artificial event so again the the what's the terms you know the horse has left the barn uh the cat's out of the bag y you can't put it back into that nook or cranny and as much as they want to say oh well you know, we can't control the weather then why did you why did you say you did why 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 did you declassify uh, Operation Popeye, where you admit the U.S. government admits to flooding out entire villages, doing exactly this thing in Vietnam. You know, just stop the lies. They're, they're Pinocchios, every single one of them. They, they can't tell the truth. It just seems like if they say it is or isn't so, then it just magically is or isn't so. And that's not, <laughs> that's not how life, that's definitely not how life works. No, and you know, already 54 million plus mail-in uh, early votes cast nationally. What do you think is the over-under for voting? I don't know how many uh, adults there are in the U.S. I think um, you know we're around 339 or so of the population, million uh, people in the U.S. But <laughs> watch, watch there be 400 million votes, you know, because there's I'm sure there's not. You know, it's it's going to be egregious to the point where the system cannot stay intact. This is part of the plan. Absolutely. Because the, they want to, they understand you can't have the United States the way it was. It's all breaking apart. And yet they want to control how it breaks up. And they want to even get more power out of the breakup. But here we go with the real revolution. It's in consciousness and it's understanding that it's all manipulated. I saw one poor gentleman who was lamenting the loss of his daughter because he listened to um, the D period, R period, and did what they recommended and, and lost her. And he blames it on, uh, you know, he blames it on everything with allopathic uh, medicine and everything that was recommended but he also blamed it only on on the left and a certain classification that's not conservative it's bigger than that it's way bigger than that this is the entirety of the system Facebook has restricted our page now threatening shows down because we're making the government look bad 
and it could influence the election. This is the Cajun Navy. Um, one of our family members that um, we've met in person, uh, Thor, um, great old guy. I don't, I don't believe Thor is with us anymore physically, but he he worked with the Cajun Na Navy and he went and uh, helped so many people so many times. One hurricane, one disaster after another. And there are people that that's all they want to do is just simply they'll put their lives on the line to help others. And when people like that are stifled, then there's there's such a problem it, it, that, you know, there's there's no excuse for the system that we have. You know, as far as finding someone to donate to, that would probably be a pretty good uh, place to donate to the Cajun Navy. Um, but I, I don't know the link, so somebody would have to do a little digging. It's just a well, thought. You, I'll, I'll put this, and I'm sure you can find them through Twitter, you know, right here, unitedcajunnavy.org. Um, good people. Good people, absolutely. You know, and, and the thing about Cajuns is, you know, they're a mix. We're all mixes. And I don't know if you ever had a Cajun cooking. It's a mix. There's a lot of spices in the mix. And there's a lot of spice in life when we recognize that there's beauty in, in everything. And the differences between us can be something to be celebrated without keeping us against each other. And the system doesn't do that. The system just pits us against each other. And they do their best, as you see this Patreon exclusive, um, to make it so that the awakening can't happen, but they can't stop the awakening. It, as hard as they try, they, they fail time and time and time again. Nature will find a way. We were not supposed to work the way we do. We, there's nothing wrong with us being like these, these horses. We're just simply social beings. We sh not, you know, that's debatable with some individuals. Given the right conditions, though, absolutely. We're social beings, you know, that want to have a, a pleasant experience. This place can be a paradise. It wouldn't take long at all. I bet you within a decade we could turn this planet into a paradise if you removed the power system from its position of authority. Indeed. Visualization is where it's at. Yes. Loka samasta suki no bhavantu. May all beings everywhere be happy and free. And may my thoughts, actions, and deeds contribute to that. Loka samasta suki no bhavantu. Namaste, which again means that I recognize that source is in me. And I recognize that source is in you. So it's that source within me, that, that, that oneness that is really at the very core of all the esoteric Tra uh, traditions, teachings that we need to grab hold of and cultivate and nurture. Source bless and namaste. Namaste.